Hey, what's up, Twitter? It's Nikolai from the Bizarre Trade. I wanted to go back on a trade I showed you a few days ago to really show you what happened with that trade. It's a trade I took, and I just shoot the video whenever I took a trade. So I took it, I posted the video, and then I wanted to see what happened. So the way I manage my trade is really simple. I look in profit, okay? I'm always thinking about looking in profit first. I want to get into a trade with no, like, no uh, risk management technique. So that's how I usually do it. So the trade, the trade was entered right there, okay? At the, uh, with a break of the Bonjour band. Pretty simple. Now, I entered at the close of this candlestick. Now you can see the whole previous video. It's going to be explained. I'll put the link below. But basically, that's how I entered. Now, reward to risk was two. So about probably here or something similar. Maybe a little, bit, a little bit below. So maybe somewhere here. Now, the way I managed that trade is I exited the first half at one to one of reward to risk. So that's about here. Now, price came back right here. But as soon as I exit the first half of my trade, I move the stop loss from here to break even. Okay. So my stop loss was at break even once I close the first half. And what happened is that the stop loss got hit at the market open the other day. So on Sunday, when the market opened on this candlestick, we had a gap. Now, if I had not moved my stop loss at that point, I would have been still, still in the trade because price didn't get all the way to my stop loss. Price came back up, but didn't hit the stop losses with here. Now, some people might find this frustrating. I don't because I want to manage the risk. If I put this back here, I'm risking having a trade that goes back to a, to a, a loss, basically. So that would make no sense to me. I prefer to lock in some profit first, move the stop loss to make sure that I end up at least breaking even on the trade on the second half. And then I'm going to move my stop plus along the way. Okay. So this is a trade where I got half the profit and I lost a little bit on the second half because of the gap. Not a lot, just a little bit. But still, this is a good trade, right? Because one to one, half with this and zero with this, this is, this is good. It makes sense. So I just wanted to get back to that trade just to do a quick recap because I know you guys were probably wondering what happened with that. But this is what happened. So I'm showing you everything. If you guys love this video, check out the channel on YouTube. Type in thetartotrade.com. Or if you're watching this on YouTube, I love it. Thanks a lot. Like the video if you liked it. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think. And subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Ciao.